Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have another uh, Sephora haul. Da -da -da -da. Everything came nicely packaged in this tiny little box. There's so many things in here. Um, I've already opened it just to make sure everything was in here um, before I filmed, but basically, uh, yes, I did pick up things during the VIB sale, but as you know, this time of year, they're having sales all the time, right through the end of the year. So I decided to pick up some more things during the Black Friday event. So, um, oh my goodness, what was it? I think it was 15% if it was um, no minimum spend um, and there was no pr promo required. And then I think it was... It was definitely more if you spent over $150, which I believe I did. And because this time there was no promo code needed, I also did manage to get a free little gift um, with an additional promo code. So let's go ahead and see what's in this box. Let's talk about the sample. I always like to pick up bougie samples. Um, I picked up this Tom Ford sample. Uh, guess what? I only got one sample. This happens all the time. It's such a disappointment. I don't remember what my other sample that I picked even was, but this is basically just a foundation sample from Tom Ford. Love their foundations. And then my free gift was this, this little bag. I love when they do these little bags. It's a fragrance set. So it comes with a whole bunch of fragrances. Plus, uh, what's the additional gift? I did get this like NARS I believe this i already have this actually this is the nars look i believe it's the laguna like lip balm i'm not going to open it because it has a seal and i already have one of these but happy to have another one love that and then if you're curious i, just, I i'm not going to go through it it's just a bag of samples that i just dropped oh one of which is the victor and rolf good fortune which i've been dying to try so i'm happy that for that because it's actually got a lot of new fragrances that um would love to sample you if you guys have been watching my channel you know this is how they get me i smell the sample and decide can't live without it and end up picking it up so that's a, how i build my collection up um and they're also nice to go in your purse i also like it because it even fits in your wallet so you, sometimes i just bring like a wristlet or, or not even just bring my wallet and um yeah anyways let's get into what's in here so oh no i got one more free grip so I have several accounts with Sephora, like several accounts. And last time I picked up one of the birthday gifts and um, I actually managed to pick up another birthday gift. This is the Ilia. I do have three accounts, so I probably will pick up the third gift, which I believe is like, what did I pick up last time? Mika, the last one is Way. So I'll try to get my hands on that before the end of the year. If you want a review on any of these, um, it's kind of like late in the year, but hey, I'd be happy to review the birthday gift. So I did get that. Oh, sorry, it has a mascara and a multi-stick, which can, I believe, be used as a blush or a lip color. Cool. And then, okay, so, oh, one item I wanted to, I just threw in this box because it was from my last order, but I couldn't find it at the time. If you're curious, this was on sale, uh, like pre-sale, pre-VIB sale, and then I managed to get an extra 20% off. This is a Pat McGrath um mothership mega celestial odyssey palette this is what the back looks like and then this is the color story that's inside i'm going to try to upside down it so that you i don't blind you with the mirror so um she has several palettes that look like this but then the color story is obviously different it's so funny because after i picked this up i realized my sister has the same palette which sometimes i feel like I mean, whatever, it's fine because we want to have our own makeup, but it would have been nice if it was the other one at least. So we would have had like something a tad different, but anywho, now we both have one. Um, okay, so that's that. And then I believe everything in this box was already on sale and then the additional Black Friday um, discount code. So I was so excited. I love a good sale on top of a sale and they're everything I wanted to get. So let's start with... Da, 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 da. let's start okay this so this was in the L'Occitane section I just like to shop the sale so I've already been using this this is from from L'Occitane sorry this is their foot cream the dry skin 
shea butter 15 percent shea butter as you can see i've already been using this i have i don't know what it is with my feet lately like i get pedicures and i do foot masks and stuff but my heels are so dry so i basically have i've never been a foot cream person but now i am and loxitan just has the best one so when i saw that this was on sale plus additional sale had to add that to my cart um and then, oh my gosh, from MAC, I couldn't believe this. So their lip oils were on sale. So I pretty much got every color that they had left in stock. So um, I got five of them. I like love lip oils. I wonder if I should have should have tried one of these on. Hmm. I have a, a lip gloss on right now, but I mean, I could. Okay, so um, I don't know. If, should, I, should I swatch these? I don't know. If you want to see a swatch video, comment down below. But anyways, I got the five of the MAC lip oils. I, I can show you what one of them looks like just randomly. Let me just pull one out. This is in the shade Office Fling. Just looks like this. And then that's the shade. Yeah, but with lip oils, because they're pretty much like lip glosses, right? Um, I mean, I don't know if actually, let's see. I don't know. If you want to see more information about the MAC lip oils, comment down below. I will make a separate video because I just want to hurry this along. Okay, next thing that, oh my gosh, in the Moroccan oil section, I was so excited to find this item on sale. This is the Curl Defining Cream. I, first of all, Moroccan oil products are the best. They smell amazing. And I like to use this cream, especially when I go on holiday and I'm not going to be heat styling um, my hair. I'm most likely just going to be leaving my hair natural. Love this curl defining cream. So this is from Moroccan Oil. Okay, then we move on to Too Faced. Too Faced Rare. I do have Too Faced, but I was looking at it, but pulling this out at the same time. So this is from Rare Beauty. This is the Brow Harmony Pencil and Gel. This, oh my gosh, there was so many Rare Beauty items that were on sale. Um, and then they went out of stock so fast, including this product, but I did manage to get it in ash gray. I don't know if this color is going to be my shade. I hope it is because the shade I wanted was in my cart and then it sold out. So, um, is one side a pencil and one is a gel? I, I, I believe so. So, oh God, I hope this is my shade. Okay. Let's, I'm, I'm curious. So let's swatch this because this is, comes out really strange. If you can see them, I don't want to ruin the. Because I want it to be as fine as possible. Okay, I think this might be my shade. Okay, how beautiful is the Rare Beauty packaging? Love it. Okay, so that's that. And then, okay, yeah. Basically, I have Too Faced and then one other product. So two of the Too Faced, actually no, some of the concealers from Too Faced were on sale, including this one, which is the Born This Way concealer. Um, I did get them in lighter shades because some of them, mm, like, oh, this one definitely is my shade. This is Seashell. This looks like this. Now... Um, love this. Look how huge this is. Like, my goodness. It's going to last me forever. And then I did get this one too because the, they had this in stock. So many of these were out of stock too. They had it in marshmallow. This is a little lighter. But um, I do prefer a lighter con a contour. A lighter concealer highlight like I like I like a brighter under eye because that is you know one of the areas that are of concern to me so I did decide since these were on double sale and these I feel like I've never seen these go on sale so I just to pick it up I just threw in my cart it was left you know they had it in stock so I said okay and then the last item I guess this is left over from the summertime this is from Bees Art this is um I think it's called like the Soleil Plage yeah um Palette. look how cute it is I've already been like playing with it how gorgeous oh my gosh and these are so pigmented and I feel like even though there's like leftover from the summer collection I feel like a lot of these are still going to be quite wearable I've actually played oh my stuff just fell on the floor <laughs> it 
if you heard that sound. Um, so what's great about this palette is um, they're magnetized little shadows. So I actually popped these out and played around with it. Um, so this is maybe not how you would see it like online and stuff, but I basically just moved the shadows around to like how I prefer the color story to look. And I find that these shades are very wearable and like aside from this green, but I feel like that here, I'm gonna, have, oh, yeah, these ones I will swatch. Okay, so if you're curious about these, look at that. It's like almost like a duochrome, right? Like I feel like that's still very wearable on the eyes. And then like, if you're curious about maybe this shade, cause it's also very kind of, look at that oh my god gorgeous and then there's even this shade here that's gorgeous mm -hmm. how beautiful anyways that is what i picked up so what am i most happy with um definitely love this and my Moroccan oil. I, I feel like these two are my two favorite purchases just because I never see these guys go on sale and then to get a double sale and not even need a promo code so that I could use my promo code for an extra gift. This was just such a win. So these are little tips and tricks I use when I shop Sephora. So hopefully they can be useful to you. And if you like these types of videos, definitely give this a thumbs up. If you have any questions or ideas for videos that you would like to see, definitely comment down below. And I'll see you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.